like put out any fires or anything or but I just need to come out and clear the air. So I'm honestly sorry guys and it's just unfortunate that it came out this way. I take full responsibility for anything I said. Oh guys, so Ben actually did something very nice today. Like I applaud his intelligence for telling TJ to apologize to the house as a whole because it's an international thing that doesn't need to go and meet the parties involved privately but he has to address it to everybody guys that made a lot of sense so guys yeah tg actually turned out his apology to the house hey guys welcome back to the channel if you've not subscribed quickly hit the subscribe button and make sure you click on the notification bell so you get notified anytime i post new videos and if you're a returning subscriber you guys are the mvps thank you all so so much so guys mm. Alliance are for me in Big Brother's house. Like, no, no, not even Alliance are for me. We already know that we already have cartels in Big Brother's house. But, guys, Omochi is in tears right now. Like, she's literally wearing her glasses, so we'll not see the tears rolling out because um, her cartel don't scatter. In as much as her cartel gun was not that strong, but at least she had her cartel. Flory, she's gone. So, who is there for her? Like, even when she and Zion has issues, who's, who's going to be the a middleman that will make them come and reconcile because um, if they fight this time this will be the end uh, like i feel sorry for her and you all know that most of these housemates don't like her so then again when the nation comes hey god i'm very good yes yeah, we all the best to him so guys yeah back to tj and ben we all know that tj had that conversation with ben and ben didn't find anything wrong with it then when he was talking about how the bad way twins are Kolo being the checker sister, just like he did with Undine, they now be talking Ibo 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 thing. And when he said that, like, people online started talking like he's tribalistic, Ebuka needs to address this, Big Brother needs to address this. So, yeah, Ebuka did, he addressed it. And at first, I did a video, I was telling you that TJ was stuttering, he was trying to, like, change it, I didn't say it. But then again, everything that was coming out from his mouth was just like, blah, 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 blah. Like he was trying to come, he was trying to muster the words out, but he was not saying, he was talking, but he was not saying anything. So after the whole thing, him and Ben had the conversation and Ben was like, okay, you need to own up to your shit. Like I was talking to Chizoba and she said, you said you didn't say it, but me, I already told her that you said it because you said it to me. So there's no point lying about it because people are out there. They heard what you said. So it's no point that, okay, you lie inside the house, this house means you believe you, and when you go outside, you start fighting the world. You need to own up to what you said and apologize. And TJ was nodding, he said, like, yeah, I get you and all that. So after that, they called all the housemates and he turned out his apology. He said he didn't mean it like that. Like, he has friends that are Igbo and all that. That is not that kind of person. That if they want to rant at him, if they want to shout at him, they should do that. That is so. He just felt like cliques are forming and he felt like like minds, like, like him now, where he's from, is a black person. That those blacks that they form to they come together to like protect themselves. So he meant it that way that the Igbos are coming together to protect themselves, not in a way of like instigating tribal war or discriminating against the Igbos and all that that he didn't mean like that and he apologized for it. And the way he was saying it, like he own up, he's going to own up for what he said. Yeah, the bad way tweets were actually shaking their head, like, yeah, it's good that you're owning up to whatever you said. And after that, Ben came again and he spoke and he apologized also that okay, he was the one that TJ was telling those stuff. So he apologized because whatever happens to his partner happens to him and all that. So and after that, all the housemates shook him and they hugged him like it's okay and everything. Calm down, dog. It's not that deep. So after that, he still went to go and meet Chizoba. And Chizoba was like, she was just a bit like she was, how do I put it now? Like she's just shocked. But then again, she actually felt that kind of science because he has been giving her some kind of attitude during the week so like she actually expected something like that for from him then again guys it is what he is but he actually looks sober like doc looks sober like he really got to him because if you know doc now doc also like doc is like our in-house therapist like he always has what to say and he's always outspoken and all that but this night almost he will catch him like almost he is really sober right now so let's just wait guys no more custodian challenge no more immunity. The only immunity they have is the HOH games, which will happen tomorrow by 2 p.m. So, guys, the game has started fully. The housemates will nominate, and whoever they nominate, 
they, that doesn't have a huge fan base gets to go home. Yeah, like when um, Honey one day and she were having a conversation why they, why they were doing their laundry and they were saying, <clears throat> excuse me, and they were saying that, okay, fine, like even if they, she goes home to, uh, next week, no problem, that the fact that Ruthie <laughs> went home before her, that gives her the usual, like now, like the house feels good, like she's happy and all that, that now, like she has friends, like they all know that anybody will win, like it's only one person that's winning, so like if you're in the midst of friends, no problem, anybody that wants to win, win, the fact that her enemies are gone, she's happy, but then again, guys, it is what it is, so what are your thoughts about TJ's apology, do you think he's sincere, or do you think he's just in it because then again, it's at the mercy of the housemates. Hit the comment section. I'd like to know your thoughts on this. So I come back again, guys, with more gist. See you all in my next video. Bye for now.